so my name is Xian Zhang. Uh, I'm an assistant professor here uh, in, in the Department of Computer Science at uh, Purdue University. Yeah, I study uh, robotics and human-computer interaction. So basically, I'm very, very interested in how robots uh, can interact with people in daily lives, uh, like in homes or like schools or hospitals. And then, how, you know, in those cases, how should the robot uh, express their, uh, you know, how, what it's thinking and then how the robot can actually understand what the person wants to do and then is trying to achieve. So our, the research goal of our, our group is to really like develop and, and design these interactive AI systems. Also, it'll be, it could be a robot or like AI um, systems uh, that really have a very social, uh, socially and emotionally natural interactions with people. And then being able to use that interactions to really help people um, get their things done, like uh, get the, achieve their goals. Whether it would be learning how to like speak a new language or uh, learning how to take care of their physical or mental health better. So right now we're having a conversation, and I'm observing uh, you, uh, you know, nodding and making a facial expressions, and based on the, those social cues, uh, I'm trying to understand. Oh, like, am I talking about interesting things, or should I move on to a different topic, or am I boring you? Right. Uh, so it's a very like adaptive and continuous process. Um, but, uh, you know, like right now, a lot about the machines or like robots or systems are not able to do that. So we are uh, trying uh, our research focus on improving the social and emotional intelligence of the robot and the AI systems. Uh, especially if the robots or, or, or AI systems become more integrated into our lives and become more interactive and more widely uh, accessible to like general public, uh, it's important for people to uh, uh, for these systems to like uh, learn how to interact with people in a very humanistic and natural way.